Hello everybody and welcome to the lesson Deriving or Differentiating Polynomials, part of the Calculus Unit in the Mathematical Methods CAS course. First of all, let's define what a polynomial is. I'll do it on the left side of the screen here. A polynomial is an expression that takes the form y equals a times x to the power of n, when a and n are constants, so they do not depend on x. And deriving this expression gives us dy dx is equal to a times n times x to the power of n take 1. Uh, the way most people are first taught this by their teachers is colloquially they'll say leave the A out the front, bring the N down and then take away 1 from the N. So let's have a look at a few simple examples uh, just to the right of that. Say we have Y equals 3X squared. Well then a is equal to 3, going by our formula to the left here, and n is equal to 2. So dy dx is equal to, well we leave the a or the 3 out the front, multiply by the n which is equal to 2, and then multiply by x, but have that x to the power of 2 take away 1, And this expression simplifies down to 6x to the power of 1, which is 6x. A more complicated example is y equals 8 times x to the power of 3 on 4. I'll write down on the side here the values of the constants, which I find very helpful for more complicated problems a is equal to 8 and n is equal to 3 on 4. So if we want to derive or differentiate this expression we use the same formula that we used above. dy dx is equal to 8 which is a times n which is 3 on 4 times x to the power of n take 1, so it's 3 on 4, take away 1, which is then equal to 24 on 4 times x to the power of 3 on 4, take away 4 on 4. I'll do it slowly which is equal to 6 times x to the power of negative 1 on 4. Let's have a look at an even more complicated example and two methods by which we can solve this. Let's have it y is equal to 2 times x take 1 squared and ultimately we want to find what dy dx is equal to. The first method we can use is to expand this out. y is equal to 2 bracket. Now let's expand this x take away 1 squared. That's x squared take 2x plus 1 which is equal to 2x squared take 4x plus 2. So from here it's quite simple to apply the polynomial derivative formula. dy dx is equal to, well we deal with the first term here, we go 2 times n which is 2 times x to the power of 2 take 1. Then we deal with the second term. 
this is take away 4. Now, n here is actually equal to 1. So it's 4 times 1 times x to the power of 1 take away 1, which is 0. And then the final term, if you ever derive a constant like 2 or 6 or Euler's number or pi, it's just 0. So this expression simplifies down to 4x take away 4 because x to the power of 0 is equal to 1. Anything to the power of 0 is equal to 1. Now here's a second method that's slightly more advanced. y is equal to 2 to the power of x take 1 squared because this x is to the power of 1 there is no coefficient directly in front of x we can treat the x take away 1 as a single unit. I'll show you how. dy dx is equal to 2, because 2 is out the front, that's this 2 here, times n, which is this 2 up here, times x take 1, still in the brackets, to the power of 2 take away 1. So it's almost as if we're treating x take away 1 as a single x, but we don't forget to include the negative 1 in the brackets. So this simplifies down to 4 x take 1 to the power of 1, which is 4x take 4. So ultimately, we come out with the same solution as the solution we had using method 1, but in method 2, we did not have to expand that polynomial. I hope that helps. Uh, if you want to know how to differentiate any of the other terms, like e to the power of x, log x, sine x, uh, cos x or tan x, please check out the other differentiation videos.